Welcome, in this video I will show you how to perform a factory reset operation on MacBook Air M4. First we have to turn off the computer by selecting the Apple menu in the top left corner of the screen, then select shut down and confirm your choice by clicking shut down right here. And once your device is completely switched off, you're gonna have to start pressing the power button until the le Apple logo appears on your screen and you see the loading uh, startup options sign underneath your Apple logo. Okay, at this point you can release the power button and one important notice, keep your laptop plugged into the power source uh, right uh, from this point. Now uh, select options in the following menu, click continue and this way you will open the recovery mode on your device. Now select uh, your user, tap next and provide a password for your MacBook. And after that you're gonna have to uh, so, uh, select uh, disk utility and click continue and at this point you have to select the Macintosh HD or or basically your startup disk it's usually uh, named Macintosh HD and at and right now you have to select erase right here format it as APFS and uh, give it any name that you like uh, I will leave Macintosh HD and then click erase click Erase Mac, then confirm by clicking Erase Mac and restart. Then wait for a while and keep your device charging in the meantime. And now at this point you're gonna have to select the Wi-Fi network in the top right corner of the screen. So just select the Wi-Fi network you want to connect to and provide a password to it, press enter. Alternatively, you can attach an Ethernet cable to your device or any other uh, network cable. Uh, once you are connected to the Wi-Fi, uh, wait a little. And now provide your Apple ID email or phone uh, number. Or, um, I'm, I, I'm not sure, maybe, no, 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 uh, email or phone number, right? Then press enter and provide a password to your Apple ID. Then wait for a while again. Okay, and once you see that your Mac is activated, uh, select Exit to Recovery and now select Reinstall macOS uh, Sequoia or, or any other uh, macOS version that you used to have before. Okay, now let's wait, agree uh, to the terms and conditions, select your Macintosh HD and click continue. And right now wait until the macOS Sequoia is installed on your hard drive. Okay, and once the installation will be complete, uh, your uh, your Mac will restart to the setup assistant, and uh, at this at that point, uh, the only thing that you have to know is that if you are selling or giving away the MacBook, you have to press the command uh, and Q combination of keys 
to quit setup and shut down your computer for the new user. Uh, and that's it for this video. I hope that it helped you. And if it did, please consider subscribing to our channel, leave us a like and a comment below. And I'll see you in the next one.